off with the colors They kinda tell me what I'm thinking I fell in love with the way we are And the way we lose it There's something different about us And the reason why we stay Letting him drive my car today. I'm really tired this morning. I didn't sleep well last night. Um, but we are going to do something that isn't necessarily so fun this morning. I alluded to this when we were coming home from Utah that something is wrong with my Tesla. My very brand new Tesla. It's nothing wrong mechanically necessarily. But um, we didn't talk about it then because the emotions were too raw and quite honestly, I really wasn't, maybe I, maybe it's all self-inflicted. I wasn't really allowing myself to feel the emotions of what happened in the moment um, or in the days afterward um, just because of what happened. Um, so the night before we left Utah, the night before I got a windshield crack, <laughs> rock chip in my windshield, um, which is why that, this, it just, that stung. Um, I thought we were going straight there. We are going straight there. You have your turn signal on. There you go. I got in this way. Um, and the only reason why I mention this is because it is, it, it happened and we've all resolved feelings, um, I hope. <laughs> I'm not gonna get a specific it person. Sounds like this some dramatic thing, but it's just it is. a car. It is just a car. Um, someone in my family hit my car the night before we left. <laughs> um, so we are going to the Tesla station, to the te Tesla service station today, this morning. It's the first opportunity we've had to go ahead and get the estimate on it to see um, how much it's gonna cost to get it fixed. Um, so that's that's fun. Um, and now I don't have a battery, hang on. All right, well my battery is gonna die at some point so we'll have to switch to using my phone, which I hate using. Um, yeah, traffic is a lot worse right now than it said it was going to be. Um, yeah, but any, like I know. So, just for a reference. Um, I said it was going to be like 27 minutes to Seattle. <laughs> this is not going to be. So someone hit my car. I won't say who. They feel absolutely horrible. Um, so because they felt so horrible, I felt like I couldn't really share my true emotions in the moment because it is just a car. Um, and they were so upset that it didn't really seem fair for me to like get upset on top of it. I knew the process <laughs> because of his car that Tesla makes it very easy to get the car fixed. It, they make it easy to work through insurance if we're going to work through insurance. So that's what we're going to go do. We're going to go get the estimate done, find out how much it is, and to see where we go from there, and then make the appointment to get it fixed. Do you ever feel you don't get out what you're putting in? All your hopes and efforts are all in vain. When you've lost everything Does it all become for granted With a wedding filming myself with my phone because I never look at the right camera. I always have to look like right here, but I want to look over here. So don't mind my eyes looking the wrong way, but we are done. That only took like 40 minutes, which was and we a lot got less. There early, so they... Well, that's what I mean. We got there 15 minutes early and it only took them, I don't know, like a half hour after that. So um, but we don't get the actual estimate for what did he say? Like five to 10 days? Yeah. Yeah. It takes him a while to print it up and email it out. To yeah. You. So unfortunately yeah, we won't have an answer for my family member today on how much it's going to cost. Um, which I think that they're expecting because so part of the reason why we had to wait clear until today to get this estimate done and 
what I didn't tell Jason <laughs> is what? that I could have gotten this done oh, well, yeah. the next day after we got back. But schedule wise, he didn't know about our trip at the time. Um, and I knew he needed to work as much as possible leading up to that trip. And then we were on our trip. And then I knew he would have to work extra time after we got back to make up for being gone. And so the first possible, sorry, it is so, or industrial. Yeah, this is crappy roads. This is here. industrial Seattle for you right down here. Let me turn you around. This is what we're driving on. <laughs> it's just massive bumpy road and it's rainy and oh goodness. So anyway, this is the first time I've had a chance to, we would have had a chance to do this appointment um, after it happened. So it just is what it is. Um, take a little bit more time um, to get the estimate. And then after that, we plan a date to have it fixed. Luckily it's not structural. There's no mechanical issues. I mean, it is structural damage. It's not, it's well, I mean, tech, outside, the outside, stuff. but cosmetic is better term for it. There's nothing mechanically wrong. Um, so there's no rush to get it fixed. I mean, if it was like a 15 year old car, we'd probably just like try to If it was it my out. pilot, I probably would just have just- Try to buff it out. And, yeah, you know, like, I wouldn't have gone through the effort. Um, and I think it probably costs more because it's the Tesla, to be honest. So- Well, it's because one panel, that's why they make cars now. One yeah. panel wraps around like a third of the car. So the yellow bump on one side, they have to replace it around the entire car. Yeah. yeah cars are coming that way because it's easier to, con you know, put together faster. Well, and they like, because they have this estimate, they, if we say yes, go ahead and fix it, no matter who is paying for it, um, they just pre-order the panel, they pre-order the parts. And so then when you come in that day to have it fixed, they literally just pop the old one off and put the new one on. It takes time, but um, it's so much easier just because they can schedule for when they know they have all the parts yeah they they have yeah so you're not without your car or whatever let me show you the crappy rain that we have right now welcome, welcome. to washington yeah welcome to washington weather usually rain here on a sunny day pops out straight ahead yeah it's beautiful yeah but you, you see nothing open. this is part of the reason why i'm having him drive um Dude. i am i'm using my phone and i hate it um i, I also spent the drive here trying to coordinate our Halloween party with our co-chair. It's been hard because like we didn't have all the information and I didn't even have a co-chair for the first part of the planning of it and we didn't have budget, we didn't have date, we didn't have... That's what happens in an all-volunteer organization. <laughs> it is. That is exactly what happens. And so it's just been... Oh, I have my earbuds in. I wonder if they can even hear you. Ah, oh, crap. All right, we're at Costco now. This is all for the store. Yeah, I'll get you some business Getting supplies. some stock up on that kind of stuff. He does a lot of packing stuff at home, so we just keep it at home. And then I just forgot a few things. I need to get some cheese and cottage cheese, and we always need bagels, so. And I'm looking for some outdoor lights that change colors. We've had some and they've just burnt out, but I want them for Halloween. And they didn't have the set we've got in changing colors so i don't know i don't want to go a target because it's just a little bit more money there but anyway i don't know why we're down the snack aisle we shouldn't be in the snack aisle there's no, no there's not there shouldn't be a reason jay what is he looking for he's looking for something what are you looking for cupcakes? what are you looking for that doesn't look good at all. Uh, I think it does. Uh, I don't know. All right, back at home. Have a battery change. Um, it's been hours. We actually got um, lunch here at home. Um, can you hear the rain? It's been doing this all afternoon. We got lunch at home and took a nap. I tried to stay awake, but I didn't have anything else to do aside from laundry. Sorry, garbage truck, hang on. All right, um, we took a solid nap. It's now four o'clock. I think I slept from one until three, 
ish. Haven't gotten off the couch though very much since. <laughs> uh, we're all just very tired. Abby has been horribly sick all week long. It was actually really, really bad last night. I almost took her to the urgent care. Jason was able to run and get her some mucinex because she just kept coughing up all this mucus from her chest and it's just, she couldn't breathe and she had a panic attack and I just feel bad for that kid and she just has so much pain and jaw pain and I just, I can't get a hold of the stupid office to schedule her surgery and it's making me so annoyed. Um, so anyway, I let her relax after school, after she did her homework and then um, Jacob and Kaylee came over, well Jacob came over and we are going out for his birthday tonight. Um, he turned 20, I believe. Yeah, so we're gonna take him out to dinner. His birthday was a couple weeks ago, but we haven't been able to go out. No, maybe his birthday is actually on the, I can't remember, I thought it was next week. But anyway, we're gonna take him out for his birthday. I'm out here because I'm waiting for Ashley to get off the bus. She's gonna come with us. Um, and he asked Chelsea to come with us. It was originally supposed to just be me and Jason and him and Kaylee, um, but then he wanted Chelsea to come, and so then we said, well, we should invite Ashley. But Abby's gonna stay home and hopefully get some um, Alfredo pasta from us to bring home for her. Because <laughs> she's like, I don't wanna exert the energy um, necessary to go out, you know, and about when I feel this crappy. So she went to school this morning, luckily, but that's because she knew she'd only have to go for like two hours. So, I'm just, maybe I should just go get the car. It's torrential downpour. But, so we're waiting for her to get home. Look at the fall color, so. Look at that big red, right out front of my window. I love it, because I just look out this window, um, and I get to see that every day. And then my little Japanese maple here. Her leaves are all falling off. She's bright red every single year. So, so pretty. Jacob has invited us to go to Cheesecake Factory with him. Okay, that doesn't mean me. Do you not no, want to go? If you don't Wait, wanna... is it the whole family? Well, yeah, Abby's Chelsea's. Not yeah, she doesn't feel good, but Chelsea's in their car with them. Sure. Yes. Didn't know that we were going. But okay. Well, we decided. I, I wanted to celebrate his birthday. Yeah. We can celebrate mine too. <laughs> I think you've gotten enough, dude. Yeah. Do you really need more? Do you need more, honey? We Maybe were... I do. Okay. Well, you ain't getting it. Yeah, this is normal rain. There's a shot of heavy rain here in Washington. Um, it's, yeah, the camera makes it look better than oh, I was lighting up a little bit. But anyways, we're under bridges. Oh, there we go. Oh yeah. Anyways, this is rain in Washington. Okay, we enjoyed dinner and Jacob went back because he's got to go to a job. Um, he's like a soccer ref. So now we're hanging out at the mall. Um, Kaylee lost her earrings that we got her in Hawaii from Nahu Nahupoku. So we went in and talked to them about buying just one earring, which I didn't think they were going to allow it, but they are. So she just has to bring it down with the certificate that we got. And then um, look at this, Kaylee. Look how cute that color is. I think Abby would like this color. I like this think? color. Isn't that cute? Yeah. That's really cute. I just wish they'd put hoods on them. Right, mm, try 80. Yeah. <laughs> um, but they, we are going to be able to bring down the other earring and buy her just one, which is nice. <laughs> Cut the cost. And then um, we're just kind of walking in walking our steps for the night. All right, well that was fun. Um, we're gonna end our night with you guys. Go home and make sure Abby gets all the meds she needs to get a good night's sleep tonight and uh, get her on the mend. But we will see you guys. That is a bright green car. It's bright green. All right, take care, you guys. Good night. Do you ever feel you don't get out what you're putting in? All your hopes.
Everything 